Hi, I'm Matt. And I'm Dave. And in this Magento Basics tutorial, you're going to learn how to disable product tags in Magento. We are indeed. And with that said, we're going to jump straight across to our Magento system and we'll catch up with you in a few moments time. So Dave, we're not actually starting in our administration area of Magento. We're on the front end. We're on the front end. <laughs> we're looking at a product page and we can see the tags option in here. And tags are one of those things where either you use them lots or you don't use them at all and you want to disable them. It's kind of one of those two boats, if that makes sense. You're either on that side or you're on that side. <laughs> you mean there's not many sellers who use them a little bit, but aren't really that bothered. <laughs> <laughs> yes, exactly. So we have a tags tab and we want to disable it. And I'm assuming that you do want to disable them as well. Now, Dave, there is a completely non-nerd way of doing this easily. No editing of layout XML files or commenting out blocks here, there and everywhere. I like the sound of that one. <laughs> yeah, you can straightforward disable the tags within Magento. Okay, so you still leave the functionality there and you can go back and enable it if you want to at a later date and there's no coding required and it's really straightforward to do. So with that said, let's jump across to our Magento admin area and you'll want to go to system, then down to configuration. Then on the next page, scroll right down to the very bottom and then over here on the left hand side where it says advanced, you'll then want to click on the link which says advanced. Advanced, advanced. Advanced, advanced. And if this is all hidden, okay, you'll want to click on this top bar so they're all expanded and you'll want to scroll down until you see the section called Madge and then Tags. There it is. So let me just scroll down and I'm going to highlight this on the screen for you which you've got Madge, Tag and then you'll want to disable it. Now go very careful here make sure you choose the disable drop down box on the same line as match tag. So don't go and do tax and don't go and do sitemap <laughs> by accident. Dave's laughing because he knows he's seen me do it before. May cause headaches. Yes, may cause headaches. <laughs> Next to match tag, choose disable and then press save config. Now, Dave, before we go back to the front end of our Magento website, we've got full page cache enabled. So we would also suggest that you do this for your site as well. So if you go up to system, then go into cache management, and then we're going to click select all on the left hand side, and then click submit on the right hand side. And the reason why we're doing this is because you may have a full page cache extension enabled. Okay. And you may also have some of the other blocks which have been enabled as well. So that if you did go back now to your Magento website and look at your product is that you probably see, well, might still see tags and go, oh my God, that didn't work. Whereas the case is, is it probably did work on your site. You're just looking at a cached version of that page. So Dave, if I now reload this page, can you see that tag has now disappeared from our options in here? Yeah. And if we ever wanted to get it back, or if you ever wanted to get it back, you can do by going to system, configuration, advanced, advanced, and you change the drop down box rather than messing around with any nerdy code. And it's really straightforward for you. So does that make sense, Dave? Yeah, I, again, I love how easy that is. <laughs> really straightforward. No need for any... Any code changes. Yeah, we don't want to get involved with that. Exactly. You keep it as simple as it needs to be. So with that said, from myself, Matt. And from me, Dave. Cheerios. So for myself, Matt, and me, Dave, we hope that you found this video tutorial helpful. If you have, then let us know by leaving a thumbs up on this video below or subscribing to our YouTube channel. We believe to use Magento, you don't need a degree in nerd. And we've created you over 300 step-by-step -step video tutorials at understandinge.com to help you. In these tutorials, you'll learn how to use Magento with no prior knowledge. How to build a fully responsive Magento website for just $99, which is about 65 quid. How you can use Magento to sell on eBay and Amazon with M2E Pro. And you'll be joined by over 6,000 fellow business owners just like you. 
And the best part is, it's free to join. So for myself, Matt. And me, Dave. We'll see you there. Cheerios.